What's up, booze? What it do? What it do? Welcome to April Nicole Tarot. I am your girl, April Nicole, and I will be doing a general read for our collective. Um, as this is a general read, um, what I say may or may not resonate. Um, and I invite you to take what resonates and to leave what doesn't. Thank you all for your likes and your shares, your comments, your donations. It is all appreciated more than you know. Um, I, I really enjoy the love that I received um, from the channel, um, from everyone. So thank you so much. Um, I'm going to leave all of my information below if you want to follow me on social media, if you want to join my online community, if you want to shop my store, my online store for dope metaphysical um, products, skincare, apparel, all of the above, I'm going to put it all in the information below. So um, without further ado, I'm going to start. I've already cleansed the space. Um, I've already meditated over the cards, um, shuffled, and spoken to our spirit teams. So, without further ado, let's get it cracking. All right. So, thank you in advance for these messages, spirit. This is for our general collective. What messages do we have for our collective during this time? During this season, ancestors, spirit guides, what messages do we have? For our collective that needs to be put out there. What are they dealing with? What are they grappling with? What do they need guidance on? What is the energy for the collective during the season? That's just a spirit guys. Let's see here. What do we have here? I hope everybody is having a great weekend. I hope you all are able to relax. Um, I hope everyone was able to um, take advantage of the full moon that we had in Sagittarius earlier this week. Um, yeah, I'm really hoping that everybody is having a good time. Oh, yeah. Okay, thank you for these messages. There we go. Okay, never mind. About to say we got three. How many more can we get? Goddamn. I'll always be running out. Mm. Okay, I'm, I'm going to start with these. So we have rock bottom. Somebody's closing a cycle. Somebody's coming to an end of some fuckery. Dragon's Lair. You know, some of you all have been slain dragons, slain demons, I'm hearing. Magical Map Shifter. This is a transition. Spirit is telling me that someone is going through a spiritual transformation. You know, um, when I was shuffling the cards, the Four of Swords kept popping out. And I was like, okay, so someone is dealing with, um, or someone's in a period of just self-reflecting, just of resting, you know, just of not saying anything, you know, um, mental communication, not so much um, verbal, you know, having conversations in your mind, working shit out, turning inward for answers, you know, I'm, I'm feeling... I'm feeling that is the energy. I mean, it could be because, you know, you've reached a rock bottom. And rock bottom sometimes isn't always about financial shit. Rock bottom can be, you can be at rock bottom dealing with motherfuckers. <laughs> Have you at rock bottom? Emotional rock bottom. Rock bottom ain't always fucking financial. Okay? So somebody's um, dealing with this rock bottom. But I'm feeling and I'm hearing that you're, you're towards the end of the cycle. Um, one, because it's bottom and you can't go anywhere down but up. And ten, and, and two, um, this card is ten. Ten signifies, signifies completion. Yeah. And you've been in the dragon's lair. You know, you've been in some real, some real cold fucking energy I'm hearing. And you didn't have to slay some shit. 
and whatever the fuck it is it 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 it, it was it was meant to change the trajectory it was meant to shake up your journey you know this was a spiritual um alignment i'm hearing this was a spiritual ascension i'm hearing okay we have balancing act okay and i mean it's next to the magical map shifter balancing act magical map shifter so whatever this is whatever this rock bottom is um you are restoring some type of karma you know it is it is balancing something out something is being balanced out definitely with the rock bottom um your karma is being restored i'm hearing you know you're you you're going through this shit um and so there's been some type of um balancing act next education hmm. so maybe somebody is going to school you know being schooled on some shit i'm also um hearing you could be somebody could be um in school you know going back to school um going back to get i don't know a degree a certificate i don't know a course i don't fucking know whatever it is you are leveling up in your education but there's also a population of y'all that's getting schooled on some motherfuckers that's getting some life lessons not no academia lessons but you're getting life lessons you know i'm hearing this let's see yeah you you're you're climbing mountains baby and this six card six is balance you know, six is also Libra energy. And I see this balancing act. So I could be speaking to a Libra. But you are out here moving mountains. You know, you are out here climbing difficult mountains. And this mountain card is falling under the dragon's lair. Yeah, you've had to climb a, a pretty difficult journey to slay some shit. You know... And you feel as though you've hit rock bottom. You know, some of you all may have had to make a choice in a situation. You know, a choice that... <laughs> and it's right under this uh, map shifter. Like I said, it changed the trajectory of your path. You know, a choice needed to be made. Or a choice had to be made. Spirit is also saying maybe you couldn't make the choice. So uh, this magical map shifter came in and made the choice for you. You know, I'm hearing either showing you some 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 education, you know, on some motherfuckers, or teaching you some life lessons that brought you to rock bottom. I'm hearing, you know, but a choice was made. There has been a, a, a cosmic choice being made. Yeah, and we have coming to life and wide open. Yeah, that's busting you wide open. That's bringing you to life. And look, it's backing up the balancing act card. I'm telling you, your karma is being restored. Your slate is being wiped clean. I mean, we... we we still going, um, we still going to clarify, but I'm just saying. But yeah, and spirit then came and, 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 and froze everybody, all them goons and goblins trying to be in your fucking way. Yeah, had to put them holes on freeze. You know, you could have been in deep freeze mode, you know? This, this is what this could also be. It could have been you in deep freeze mode. And now you are wide open. You know, now you are coming to life. You know? Take it as it resonates. Let's see. Because I'm going to build on these. I was going to pick these up, but I want to get some more clarification. So I'm going to leave them out. 
and build on these so all right thank you for these messages spirit i'm gonna pull from tarot and um get some clarification on these cards so we have rock bottom and education thank you for these messages in advance spirit the rock bottom and education with some clarification on this Ooh, the fool yeah rock bottom you needed to start over it was time for some new beginnings it was time to reset it was time to put that clock back to 12 or reset that timer back to zero 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 and some of you all may have been seeing zero zero zeros or five five fives or nine 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 you know, but zero is here. This full card speaks to a new journey. This full card speaks to um, taking risks, you know, freedom, adventure, a leap of faith, you know, having a new journey. Oh, this is so beautiful. Okay. I'm so glad we getting out of that old raggedy ass fucking energy that we have been in okay what else we got dragon's lair and mountains thank you for these messages spirit can we get some clarification on this dragon's lair and mountains something flipped let's see where'd it go where'd it go where'd it go Did it... i thought i saw something there it is nine of swords yes wounded fucking warrior you know no that's not the nine of swords it's nine of wands i'm sorry i'm looking at this like no 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 so this is you reaching a breaking point you know and this is also whoever this other party is they're feeling defeated they have anxiety over this they are regretting not treating you right. But I also feel like this is your energy too, reaching a breaking point. You know, not trusting. This is you not trusting someone. It probably is, you know, whoever's in this energy, most likely, namely. You know, this person could have given you fear, anxiety, you know, you, 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 you have motherfucking uh, panic attacks and shit like that. You know, but this is also them as well. Regretting. Regretting making you get into battle with them. Or regretting turning this into a battle. Because they lost. Let's see. Thank you for these messages, Spirit. What else do we have? We have making a choice and magical map shifter. Can we clarify that, Spirit? Let's clarify that for the collective. The sun. Woo. The sun. Best card in the deck. So we have magical map shifter. We have making a choice. That choice that was made, that was the right choice. You got the sun shining on that choice. You got favor shining on that choice. You know, you're you are being granted a rebirth. You know, this is this is speaking to having a success in something. Fulfilling your happiness, receiving clarification. Yeah. The right choice was made. Okay. Now let's get to balance and act which was backed up by wide open and coming to life. Thank you for these messages, Spirit. This is appreciated. Please clarify these Oracle cards, balancing act, wide open, coming to life. Knight of Wands. Okay. Hmm. You could have been dealing with a player. I'm hearing somebody who was charming. 
that had a big ass fucking ego fire energy hmm. king of swords it could have been a, a air sign Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, take it as it resonates. Hmm. Yeah, a player. You know, I I, I, I always say fuck boy when I see Knight of Wands. Um, when I'm thinking of relationships. But this King of Swords energy, they could either be um, an air sign or you, or this is you cutting their ass the fuck off with a ferocity you know however this relationship ended it ended very motherfucking shing i'm hearing you know you could have fucking told they ass off Ooh, i'm gonna take all of these you probably you probably told they ass off i don't know but yeah that's what that's what that's what the ancestors are saying yeah, you're you're this is a tower moment. You're going you're coming out of a tower moment where some shit needed to crumble. You know, and this is backing up your deep freeze. You know, spirit had to put some shit on fucking ice. I'm hearing forever. This is a tower moment, you know, breaking up. Um you may have had some shit revealed. You know, but I'm feeling something was quick. This tower moment with this King of Swords energy, quick. Either there was a quick cutoff, there was some words fucking had, where you told a motherfucker what was what, but that's what I'm hearing. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm hearing. Six of, six of Wands, this talks about success. I'm telling you, the ancestors is smiling on this new path you're on. The ancestors are smiling on this new path that you are on. You got Ace of Cups, so this means that you got new love coming. That means you have new partnerships coming, new feelings. You are open. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling that a lot of y'all are opening up. Y'all's heart chakras is opening up. You know, you are aligning into your intuition. You are aligning into your spirituality. And this rock bottom probably was the catalyst for that. You're having some type of awakening now, which is beautiful. Page of Cups, okay? This is this is this is chasing your dreams. This is following your calling. You know, this is this is also speaking to your choice. Making your choice. I'm hearing a lot of y'all decided to follow y'all's dreams. Fuck the heart. Some of y'all decided to follow y'all's fucking dreams, to follow y'all fucking mind. And say, fuck the heart. You know? Fuck the heart. But you got new love coming in. And spirit is saying that they're going to be a hopeless romantic. They're going to be charming. You know, they're going to be, you know, attractive. You know, but be careful because they may have unrealistic boundaries when it comes to relationships. They may be hiding some type of attachment issue. You know, so spirit is saying, use your discernment, you know, as you are going out here being open, as you are going out here, you know, um, readying yourself up, you know, to date again, you know, and have your hot girl summer, your hot boy summer, whatever. Spirit is saying to uh, be careful for it's still wolves and sheep clothing out there. You you just saw through one of them. It's a million more out this hole. Okay, so be careful. Nine of Pentacles energy. This speaks to fulfilling, um, uh, 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 you, you, excuse me, your abundance. Abundance. You know, uh, for fulfilling that coin. You know, success. Being self-sufficient. You know, uh, having confidence. You know, where you're heading, the sun is shining on you. You, you you're not going to have to worry about money. Because you got fulfillment coming your way, Spirit is saying. What's at the bottom of the deck? Three of Wands. Ooh, yes. Look at that. That's you. That's you looking out on the world, thinking of a master plan. Yes. When I, when I think of, when I see the Three of Wands, I be thinking of the song, thinking of a master plan. You know, Three of Wands speaks to expanding, 
looking ahead, you know, not holding back, you know, not being afraid, you know, uh, uh, willing to put in the work to go, to go, to go the extra mile to get what it is you fucking want, you know? So yeah, baby, you, you, I, I'm hearing ain't no stopping you. You, you, you on a new journey. You're coming out of rock bottom. You know, some of you all have been meditating or, or just spending time by yourself, not really trying to turn up, not really trying to hang out with the friends, talk on the phone or whatever. Y'all been in y'all head trying to get in y'all bag. It is going to pay off. You know, spirit fucks with that. The universe is smiling down on you. And wants to give you the fucking world. Spirit want me to tell y'all, keep fucking going. Keep fucking going. Okay? Remember what you then came out of. Okay? Remember your schooling. You didn't you didn't pay all of that fucking emotion, no tuition for nothing. Let this karma continue to balance out so you can move forward. Let these ancestors and spirit guides continue to uh, restore and balance out your karma. So you can move forward and have better fucking uh, experiences. Okay? So, that's my time. I ain't gonna hold y'all. Um, thank you for tuning in. Um... I really appreciate y'all's support. If you uh, resonated with any of the messages, please feel free to let me know in the comments below and also give me a thumbs up if you really resonated with uh, the messages because that really helps the channel. Um, and, you know, tell a friend, you know, send it to a friend you think it may resonate with, you know, each one teach one. Um, I will check y'all next time. Um, I'm sending you all love and light. I'm hoping you're having an amazing day, hour, minute, second, wherever it is I am catching you um, with this video. All right. I will be dropping more um, readings for the Zodiacs. Okay. I'm, I'm moving down my line. Thank you all for your patience. I appreciate y'all. And okay. That's my time, y'all. Peace. <laughs>